What is up, guys? We are back in the lab. And going back to some Goshi centric type topics today, we're going to be focusing on a technique a lot of Yoshis have been starting to implement. And it is Egg Trump. Egg Trump is a new way of setting up kill confirm in terms of trumping. So Yoshi doesn't really get much out of Trump. He could like Nair, but you know, sometimes it's not really like consistent and he can up air. Back air can be too slow to Trump with or the hitbox is just really weird. Right? And you know, you can set up a Trump with a down B snap or just like doing the auto snap as well. Um, but you know, Yoshi is a little bit hard to do the auto snap with sometimes. And again, you know, snapping is getting the snap and like getting a weak nair can be sometimes weird. And then if you try to get the strong nair, more often than not, you're just going to send the opponent away instead of, you know, off stage. So how can Yoshi mitigate this, right? Well, it's what we call Egg Trump. So the reason Egg Trump works is due to a mechanic with Egg Toss and how Yoshi works with grabbing the ledge. So you'll notice when I try to grab ledge with Egg, it takes a while before I can grab it. Yoshi has to throw the Egg like completely almost before I could actually grab that ledge. This is a property of egg toss where you can't grab ledge until you either completely throw the egg, like you, the egg is out of Yoshi's hand, or the egg breaks. If the egg breaks, then you could grab ledge. But if it doesn't break, you have to wait that little second. Why is this a good thing though, in this case? Well, if you soft throw the egg upwards and then trump the opponent, the opponent will sometimes get hit by this egg and then you'll be able to kill confirm them off of it with a forward air, a back air, or even sometimes a nair as well. Namely, you're going to be using forward air though. You know, it's our strongest um, aerial in this case and as well in the scenario where... In the scenario where... The opponent's at a low enough percent where, you know, if I try to back air, it won't work. Like for a kill confirm, the forward air spike will kill confirm. So you're able to sometimes get a kill at like, you know, 70%. It can even start confirming at like 55, for example, with egg trump. Like so. So real quick about trumps is they are influenced slightly by DI. So if I have um, Palu DIing right and left, the trump might be a little bit different where egg, the egg won't hit them because they DI'd right, the egg will miss. But if they DI left where the egg will hit on DI right, it might miss on DI left. So you want to be cognizant of if the opponent does know that, you know, DI does influence Trump and generally try to put the egg in like a middle position or generally I just like to cover the DI in because, you know, at least I'll get guaranteed damage. So the inputs for this um, egg Trump is going to be as follows. You're, you're going to egg as they are about to stop ledge. You don't want to do it too early because if you do it too early, then what's going to end up happening is you're going to get trumped. You want to soft throw the egg back. So the way you do this is you press B really quickly and you quarter circle the control stick back. And then after that, you want to drop down immediately hold the right stick forward and then hold it back and jump this will get you a turnaround double jump only yoshi is able to do this unless you have a multi-jump 
but it's how you set up the fair after. If make sure that you don't hold it too long to the right, because then you'll just start drifting out. But also, if you forget to hold directly right, you won't get that turnaround, and you'll have to substitute for a back air trunk instead of a forward air trunk. And then after that, you just basically immediately buffer the fair after, preferably with the control stick. Um, you can use the A button, but I find it that a lot of the time if you try to use the A button, you'll end up getting a buffered back air instead, which again, it's not what we want. So without Palu recovering, it would look like this. And with Palu recovering, like that get that trump going i like to throw it like right in this area where it's kind of like right above the ledge because usually you have to know to hold hard out in order to not get trump at that type of angle you want to be really careful that you're not hitting the stage though um when you go for the trump so obviously the egg will disappear and then that's not a fun time. Then the way you practice this with the training mod pack is just like what I'm doing. You keep going for it and you make sure that the opponent is buffering air dodge the whole time. Always buffering air dodge. And then you just keep practicing until you start to get more of a feel for it. Boom. A big thing when you're trumping as well is to keep in mind the type of character you're trumping. Some characters, when you trump them, they're, they have way, way um, different trump animations. So Ness, for example, goes way farther out compared to Palu. And this is something you want to keep in mind when you're trumping, that, you know, the character's animation will actually influence how easy a character is to be trumped. So Ness, for example, um, doesn't go nearly as close. So I want to place the egg a little bit farther. Compared to with Palu, I was placing the egg way closer. Obviously, yes, Ness can still influence if uh, Ness wants to drift in more, drift out more with the eye. But... These are the type of things you have to consider while trumping is that some characters trump animations will be different and they'll go closer or farther from the ledge depending on the character. Finally, what characters does Egg Trump work best on? These are going to be the characters that like to recover with air dodging because if they like to the directional air dodge, then obviously setting up the Egg Trump will be much easier. Characters with no hitboxes on the recoveries or that have a very exploitable recovery pattern. So, Palutena, um, teleport recovery, no hitbox. Um, think of Pits, um, they're, they're just a very linear, no recovery hitbox. Same thing with Joker, when he has Arsene. Now, what characters are not so easy to egg trump? Well, these are gonna be the characters with hitboxes all around them, or too much options for mix-up. Whoa. Whoa! Comes to mind. Where if I try to egg trump him, right? More often than not, if I try to do that same type of setup, I'm just gonna get hit by up B. Right? There is a workaround of just drifting back and then doing it. However, in my opinion, um, they can just offset it a little bit. And you might be too slow to where they could just buffer an option right after. The workaround to this is using wave bounce back up B. You get to snap way, way faster. And you could still put the egg in the same exact type of spot. To get up, to get a trump. Whereas... This, you know, if you're a little bit off, you get clipped by the upbeat. But with here, you could go out pretty far 
and still be able to trump the opponent as long as you're comfortable with the input. Like so. I'll link the guide on how to wave out up B in the description below. But against these types of characters anyway, I still don't necessarily recommend going for the trump all the time. Again, just because, you know, this is a very risky option. And it is a pretty hard option too. Especially like under pressure and such. But it is the best way in my opinion to work around these characters with hitboxes. But um, yeah guys, that's really all I have for today. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments. I'll try to address all the ones I can. And really make sure that you're also practicing Egg Trump on as many characters as you can, right? That's realistic to actually Trump. You want to be, like we said, you know, everyone has such weird ways that you can... Every character's Trump animation is pretty unique. And you want to be comfortable Trumping all of them. You know, with the different ways, if I need to wave bounce, if I can just regularly do it. And the timings for all of them too. But with that, I'm going to be wishing you guys a great rest of your day. And I hope to see you again soon. Peace.